Now, a massive political war has erupted over Congress MP Rahul Gandhi's comments at a Cambridge Ideas uh, for India conference. Rahul Gandhi had said in that uh, conference there, the conclave, where he spoke about India and how he said that India is currently is not in a good place and that Prime Minister Modi does not listen. He's also said that India is witnessing an attack on the institutions that built the country, which is now occupied by the deep state. Taking a jibe at the BJP, Congress MP has said that the Saffron Party is spreading kerosene all over the country. He's also accused BJP of controlling the media. BJP, AIDMK and several other parties launching an attack on Rahul over his comments. BJP has said that Rahul Gandhi is habitual offender who only goes on to make a graver mistake than the previous one. Targeting Gandhi, AIDMK has said defaming India in the international arena is part and parcel of the Congress's culture. Uh, India is not in a good place. They have, the BJP has sped, spread kerosene all over the country. You need one spark and we'll be in big trouble. We have massive level of polarization. Uh, we have huge unemployment. We have, as I said, the backbone of, of uh, employment broken. And we have massive concentration of wealth. From there, everything flows down. Our Prime Minister doesn't listen. के आदत हो गई है राहुल गांधी और गांधी परिवार की मोदी जी से नफरत की आग में जलते जलते वो भारत माता के खिलाफ ही वक्तव्य देने लगे हैं और इस सेमिनार का शीर्षक कांग्रेस पार्टी को आइडियाज फॉर डिस्ट्रॉइंग इंडिया रखना चाहिए क्योंकि यही उनकी मानसिकता है देखिए विदेश में जाके देश को बदनाम करना ये उनका पहला शगल नहीं है प्रारंभ से पूरी कांग्रेस इसी पद चिन्हों पर चलती है जब कांग्रेस खतरे में होती है तो उन्हें संविधान खतरे में नजर आता है राहुल जी कांग्रेस पार्टी खतरे में है और जब तक आप हो तब तक ये खतरे में ही रहेगी कांग्रेस पार्टी द कांग्रेस पार्टी एंड राहुल गांधी टाइम एंड अगेन have now become the Bharat Badnami Brigade and the manner in which while they oppose Prime Minister Narendra Modi, while they oppose the BJP, which is their democratic right, they go to the extent of opposing India, India's democratic institutions and India's armed forces itself shows their political desperation and frustration. Defaming India in the international arena is a part and parcel of Congress culture. The party which has showcased only snake charmers as India, the face of India to the outside world for decades, has never showcased the true potential and the true identity of India. And Rahul Gandhi talking about democracy and international forum, what else could be a laughing stock? A party which has used Article 356 to the maximum number of times and dissolving state governments. He talking about uh, cooperative federalism, he talking about democracy, he talking about uh, destroying institutions is nothing but a laughing stock. Situation has not yet come, but it has started. Early stage itself, if the government properly cut it down all these things, then our country will be a very peaceful country. My request to the Honorable Prime Minister, don't encourage who are all the organizations try to spoil our peaceful nature of this country by creating unnecessary problems about some sentiment issues, sensitive issues. For that, he has to take severe steps. We have also said that the government has been working on the BJP, the government has been working on the BJP, सेंट्रल एजेंसी जिस प्रकार से मुहिम चला रही है ये ठीक नहीं है लोकतंत्र के लिए देश में डेमोक्रेसी जरूर है लेकिन इस प्रकार की डेमोक्रेसी जिसका गला सेंट्रल एजेंसी घोट रही है ये हमने उससे पहले कभी देखा नहीं था जो भी आपके खिलाफ बोलेगा जो भी सच बोलेगा उनके खिलाफ सेंट्रल एजेंसी को लगा दिया जाता है राहुल गांधी ने जो बात कही है वो सच है all right, and that's a re those are reactions coming in on Rahul Gandhi's comments. Of course, the BJP not taking it well, calling the comment itself as anti-national. Here, Rahul Gandhi spoke on an international forum at uh, the United Kingdom Ideas for uh, Exchange while they've 
uh, well, there was a conclave that was held. He spoke on India not being at a good place and how BJP uh, has really destroyed the fabric of the country and that Prime Minister Modi does not listen. This the BJP calls as anti-national comment.